Hi, I'm Lucy Huxley, I'm the editor of TTG and I'm here at the ABTA Convention football match at this stadium in Gran Canaria. Uh, today we've got You Travel, the operators team playing CNM recruitment, the agents team, and it looks like being a great game. You can see they're just warming up at the moment and uh, there's a lot of tired people already, which is a bit of a worry, but it's a, it's a hot day, so we'll see how they fare, but join us later and we'll let you know how they get on. Okay, I'm here with Angus Chisholm, who's the boss of the CNN recruitment team. And uh, Angus, you haven't actually been very lucky in previous years. Do you think that you're uh, going to be victorious this time? I think, Lucy, we probably will be, actually. We've uh, changed the team. We brought some young lads in. We've uh, had a pre-match warm-up. Uh, we were victorious in that. Um, can you tell us any of your secrets? I mean, the other team won't hear this before, before this goes out. So any sort of tactics you can let us in on? Well, we've got some good players. We've got a lad from Budgie from Teletext, very good. Phil Turner from Broadway. We've got a couple of lads from CNM that have come out. We're going to start with probably a 4-3-3 formation. Look to attack them down the wing. Um, hopefully score more goals than they do. That's the plan, really. Paul, uh, you've been victorious every year till now. So do you think you can do the same again? Well, it's going to be very difficult for us this year, Lucy. They've uh, got a lot of new players. Uh, they've flown some, a couple of players in. I know they've flown them in specially on a 24-hour mission just to play this game. So that's how serious they're taking it. Uh, we, you know, we've got the skill. We've got the, uh, we've got the knowledge. We've got the, you know, hopefully we've got the ability to win the game. Joe, can you tell us what the match has been like so far? Who's doing the better? Mm, well, what, from what I can see, the orange team are running in one direction and the white team are running in the other direction. And actually, it, as, in terms of who's doing best, I don't know. I have to say the orange team have the best legs. I was going to say, have you spotted anybody yet that you quite like the look of? Uh, well, I think that number 18 might be a bit tasty myself. Let's just check out who number 18 is. <laughs> All right. What makes number 18 so special? Well, the fact that he can run helps uh, so but he can't run too fast so that means he can't run away so and actually he's now oh he nearly got a goal then actually so do you know I can spot a winner a mile off. not just a pretty face then thanks very much Joe. Keep going, one. Go on, Dean. Go on, Dean. Go on, have a go. Have a go. So Agnes, after being a, <laughs> Agnes, being like, a, loser, being a loser for many, many years, what's it like to win? Well, I always think I'm a winner, Steve, myself. But on the football pitch, I think it's the first time we've shown our quality, shown our class. We had some decent players out there, played some great football. One nil was a bit of a flatter. We should have, we should have won. Well, no, it's not a flatter. I'm, I don't know what I'm talking about. We should have won by three or four, really. Second half, they came back into it and they had a lot of chances. But I think overall, we deserve to win. Can you talk through the highlights of their team play? Because I was particularly impressed by Mark Bennett on the line when you go, um, here's a goal, uh, here's a ball. Oh, where's he gone? Well, and there again, there again, also the penalty. I believe the penalty was well, a bit of a highlight. They were a bit unlucky with the penalty. I think the decision was, was a bit harsh. <laughs> but I think with, the, uh, with Mark Smith, I think I'll buy my beer tonight because that was very generous of him. Okay. Uh, Paul, as a loser, would you like to come forward? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well, you win some, you lose some, Steve, you know. <laughs> uh, I think you won 14 in the road until today. Oh, I think something like that, yeah. <laughs> so what went wrong? Was, well, it, they, was they, it new faces? Was they, it better players? Well, they flew some players in just for the game, Steve. I mean, that's not really, <laughs> that's not really cricket, is it? <laughs> oh, they actually took it seriously, you mean? They did, yeah. They were a very good, very good display. Can't take it away from them. But we missed an open goal and missed a penalty, so it could have been a draw. So you're blaming Thomas Cook? I'm blaming everybody but myself. <laughs> Thank you very much.